Good morning, Facebook. This is Lori Flickinger coming to you live from Lori's Wellness Loft. And for those of you joining me for the first time, I am a health and life coach and an advanced energy healing practitioner. And my goal is to come on to bring you little coaching gems that you can start applying to live a happier, healthier life now. So good morning, everyone. Welcome to Friday. We made it through the week. I wanted to just take a moment to jump on today. People have been saying, I haven't heard from you, Lori. Where have you been? Lori has been busy creating programs for her mindfulness uh, workshop that I'm teaching right now. But with the big scare of, hello, Selena, I should come around and say hi to you today. Are you working? With this big virus scare where everybody is so concerned I said, let me do what I do best and come on and talk to you about how to increase your health, wellness, immune function, all that. And a lot of people are confused as to what coaching is or who needs a coach and what coaching is about. So what better time now to explain it to people? And there are so many misconceptions about coaching. So I'm here to kind of give you some information. If you have questions, please drop them in the comments below. Let me know if you have any questions about who a coach can help. So I want you all to think back in your life to a time when you had a coach that really affected you, a mentor, a parent, a teacher, somebody who had information that they were able to give you information you didn't currently have and give you a different spin, a different perspective. And what they do, a good coach, mentor, teacher, will then observe you doing what you're doing and critique and make little changes along the way. So what happens is I have people that I coach, people who come into this coaching room, let me explain this to you, are highly functional people. I have business owners, I have physicians, I have doctors, I have people in um, politics that hold really important positions, believe it or not, that come for coaching. I myself have a coach. And people who come for coaching have the luxury, and I'm going to call it a luxury, of having this mentor, this person that has all of this information that can watch them, critique them, and make them even better. So think of it from sporting, okay? If you're a golfer and you're taking golfing lessons, your coach is going to watch you, is going to point out things that you can't see because you don't know what you're doing wrong because you think you're doing everything great. I um, had a story that I was listening to about a physician that had a coach that his coach would come into surgery with him, watch him perform surgery and take notes and bring his level of care up, just kept ratcheting it up. So I want you all to think about, hello Molly, how are you? When is the last time you said, I'm go I need to really improve? And I know that this is important for somebody, especially in my um, line of work. I have to constantly take continuing education courses. I have to constantly hone my skills if not, I become irrelevant. I'm not able to help people if I'm not helping myself. So I'm constantly coaching. I'm constantly going to courses that are going to help enrich me and make me the best that I can possibly be in my practice. And that's what I also do for all of you. So people who are coming for more emotional support, okay? Hello, Carmen. No, I didn't eat the chicken broth last night. Carmen's on me because I eat way too much sodium. So I'm really cutting it back. I feel better, Carmen, thank you. You're saving my heart. Anyway, so people who come to me for emotional support or come to me to correct relationship issues, think about this. You've been in this relationship for I don't know how long and you're doing the same thing over and over again, expecting a different result. So when you sit with me and we coach together and you tell me what you're currently doing, I'm allowed to take an object, a objective look at what's going on in your situation say, hmm, that's interesting. Have you ever tried to say it this way? And the person looks at me like with like these new eyes, like, wow, I never thought of saying it that way. I said, yeah, exactly. 
That's why you're here. You're asking for my input. And hey, it may work out great or it may not. But the thing is, in order for you to get a different result, you have to change what you're currently doing and do something different. The only thing that's gonna catapult you people is having someone coach you, adjust what you're doing, and give you suggestions. Watch you when you start to use these new behaviors and modifications and then keep directing you in the right direction. Good morning, Linda. So if you are intrigued, if you are enthralled, if you have always wanted to give coaching a try, give me a call at 609-561-LORI. The other great thing is if you don't want to come out, if you want to stay home in the comfort of your own home, 50% of my people that I coach, I coach over the phone. You don't ever have to leave the comfort of your home. I can do nutritional coaching. I can do life and health coaching. I can do business coaching, relationship coaching, all kinds of coaching that I can do just from being on the phone. So if this was helpful, please hit that little share button in the corner of your phone and share this to your timeline. And hello, Tony, how are you? And also, if you're interested in coaching with me, please give me a call today at 609-561-LORI. Have a safe and happy holiday, and I will talk to you all soon.